yes, exactly. I'm using this scheme called the Match Retirement Savings Scheme for my parents. But I just wanted to share what am I currently doing because I received a question from a community member. Uh, she was asking me, apart from REITs, are there any other financial tools uh, that I am using right now? Uh, what you can see is that uh, the Match Retirement Savings Scheme uh, is a scheme that runs from for five years starting in 2021. This scheme allows me to top up $600 to my parents' retirement account and the reward is that the government will also put in $600. So that's a one to one dollar matching. In total for this entire scheme, since it runs for five years, the maximum amount or the reward will be $3,000. How does it help my parents, especially since I'm using it to build their retirement fund is that of course there's the usual interest rates and of course i myself who's the person who's making a top up i'm also getting a tax relief i get to win my parents get to win why not take up this scheme if you like this uh, idea uh, you can hit the like button so that youtube can share this video with more people so now you might be thinking i'm CPF having a lot of constraints in the manner that we can withdraw the money. Yes, they are. But I'll also urge you as a viewer to take one step back and really understand this principle called the risk reward ratio. And that's the particular bonus topic that I wanted to bring about. Because if you look at all the financial tools that you know, what is actually the key objective that we want. We want to maximize our returns. But I also wanted this video to talk about what is the risk taken in order to get the return. So using the uh, match retirement savings schemes as an example, what is the risk? Of course, there's all those constraints about withdrawal, but let's put that one side. Me putting in 600, the government puts in 600. What's the risk? It's almost negligible. What is the reward? It's a 100% return because I put in 600, I get by 600 so it's like this risk reward ratio is almost like infinity when the eye be became aware of this principle was uh, around the sixth year of uh, investing because i was looking at all the financial tools like uh, reads uh, options you know the singapore savings bonds the treasury bills so this point was kind of crucial and i'm still using this investing principle to guide my selections in all the financial tools that I want to use. If you'd like to reduce your risk in investing in REITs, I recommend that you watch this particular REITs cheat sheet video. Uh, that video has helped me to understand more about what type of REIT I should invest and that naturally reduces my risk.